Chris Spear here. Uh, today we're going to talk a little bit about the square stand. Uh, we're in the process of setting up two drive-in movie theaters uh, with the square stand. They need to have a front printer for the uh, for the customers and then they need to have a kitchen printer as well. So what we found was the Epson TM T88V uh, was the most inexpensive model. We bought four used ones on eBay. But after we got the printers, and we, we, did, check the, we did check the compatibility, the printers are supposed to be compatible uh, on some of the square lists, but on other lists they show that they're not compatible. So when you plug in the, any of one of these printers before we reprogram them, what you'll see on the screen is a message that says that it's incompatible. And initially we thought that that meant we could not use these printers. But what we found after some additional research was that the printer is classed in vendor mode. Um, so if we switch it over to printer class, um, then they'll work with the square stand. Reprogram this machine. So first thing you wanna do is you wanna shut it off. And then you wanna press and hold the feed button. While you turn it on, keep holding it. And it's gonna pop out here. It's gonna tell you select modes by pressing the feed button. So if you press and hold it for one second or more, it's gonna give us the next sheet, which is gonna let us go into our customized value settings, which is number three. So if you press three, three times, and then press and hold. So one, two, three, press and hold. And now we've got the customized value settings. You'll see number 11 is USB interface settings. So you're gonna press the button 11 times and then press and hold. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, hold. And then it's going to say USB interface settings. Uh, zero will return you to previous menu. One will take you to class. So we're going to press one and then hold. So one time and then hold. Now we're into USB interface settings. Um, so right now you can see it, that the star tells you that it's in vendor class mode. And that's the reason that it's not working with the square stand. So we need to put it into printer class. So to do that, we select number two. So we're going to press two. Uh, we're going to press the feed button twice and then press and hold. One, two, press and hold. And then this prints off. It says saved. You can turn off the printer. So now we're in printer class. And then it shows your mode, mode again. So we're gonna go ahead and turn the printer off. Plug the USB cable into the square stand. Turn the stand back on. And then we're going to turn the printer on. And then you can see here, Choose printer, USB printer to Epson TM T88V is set up. So press this, and then we're gonna do a print test. So I'm gonna hit print test, and you'll see it print just like that. So there's your test print. So that, that's how easy it is. We just set up four of these for the drive-in. We're gonna use two of them as customer printers and two of them as kitchen printers. So we'll be able to set each one of these up individually. Thanks for watching our video. Um, if you need more instructions, look below. We'll have a link there that will show you um, detailed instructions step-by-step, step, a little bit slower. Make sure you subscribe. We're gonna be doing more troubleshooting videos. Also, if you have any further questions or anything we can help you with, if you felt like this video was useful, drop a comment, shoot us a thank you. Uh, we'd love to hear back from you. And uh, if you felt like we le left anything out, feel free to chime in and help us out. Thanks again.